In June of this year, the chairman of the Senate of the Republic of Kazakhstan, Kasim Jomart Tokayev, made a statement that immediately became sensational. The politician said that the president Nursultan Nazarbayev most likely will not run for the president in the next election, in 2020. Speaking frankly, I don't believe that President Nazarbayev will go to the presidential election in 2020, because he's a very wise man and absolutely reasonable. I think that in 2020 we shall have presidential elections with other candidates, except President Nazarbayev. Special weight to words impart the weight of the author, indeed Takayev, the second person in the hierarchy of Kazakhstan's political system. The second person publicly admitted the possibility of Nosultan Nazbayev's lifetime departure from the post of president. Previously, neither of those close head of state didn't allow this. Naturally, the words of the senator caused public outcry both in the country and abroad. Many experts suspect the words of Takayev attempts to surround the lifelong Kazakh president to hurry him, the decision-making to leave. Others suggested that none one of the political elite of Kazakhstan without instruction from about wouldn't have dared on a such big statement. The journalists of London's website Intelinews.com wrote that if Nazarbayev stepped down, he would likely ensure that all the levers of power still remained in his hands behind the scenes. He has already taken some steps in this direction. For example, the bill about the Security Council, which allows him to lead the authority for life. This is the fifth consecutive term for Nazarbayev. According to the Constitution of the Republic of Kazakhstan, the same person may not be elected head of the Republic more than twice, but this restriction doesn't apply to the first president. And it should be recognized that the elections in Kazakhstan have never been considered free or fair. On the last election, in 2015, Nazarbayev received, according to official data, 97.8% of the vote by providing, therefore, the 30 years of interrupted presidency. For almost half a year, with the easy hand of Takayev, the rumors about the change of power in Kazakhstan sound with the new force. The most popular questions – when we leave and who will replace? If the first question, it seems, is directly dependent on the state of health of the president, Nazarbayev is 78 years old, and recently he began to disappear from the political scene more and more often. According to the press, he is often provided with the medical care abroad. The second question resembles the equation with all known owns. Kazakhstan has an authoritarian regime in a soft farm, and the political institution are raised a week. The power structure of Kazakhstan, like many post-Soviet states, has a pyramidal system. From top to bottom, a number of patronage networks distribute money and power in favor of those who have the right connections. From the time immemorial in Kazakhstan is the family ties. The list of alleged candidates for the new ruler of the country confirmed this. In this list, only relatives and especially close to the presidential family. The first potential successor of the of Nazarbayev is the chairman of the Senate, Kasim Jamar Tokayev. If the leader of the nation suddenly dies, Tokayev will be the first in line for the presidency, at least in the interim. Another potential successor is Karim Masimov, the twice former prime minister and now the chairman of the powerful National Security Committee. Masimov has a proven reputation and is loyal to Nazarbayev family. Next on the list of persons to be considered, Imangalitas Magambetov, the current ambassador of Kazakhstan in the Russian Federation. Another often mentioned, thought controversial for a number of reasons successor is the eldest daughter of Nazarbayev, Dariga. Another relative, also often mentioned, as a candidate is Timur Kulibayev, an economist from Russia who is married to Nazarbayev's second daughter, Dinara. Who exactly will have the honor to become the second after Nazarbayev is not yet clear. But it's known that the political heir of the first president of the country will be close to the top of the pyramid. Therefore, regardless of the results of the 2020 elections, Kazakhstan should not expect the radical changes in the next decade.